this police administration um, is transparent. That declaration from City Police Commissioner Kevin Davis came in response to repeated questions again about the Baltimore Police Department's use of a privately funded aerial surveillance program. It was kept secret between January and August. Now it will be used again for Fleet Week and the Marathon before the public has a chance to weigh in at a city council hearing later this month. Something being a secret versus something not yet being, uh, not yet being disclosed or vetted with the community, I think those are different things. I never intended to surprise anyone by this. Again, here are the observed routes. The department used a lengthy scenario. presentation about the program as a sales pitch today, showing the images it records from 8,500 feet. Police claim they can be used to track criminal offenders and cars. The images are grainy at best. Police say they're most helpful when used with cameras on the ground. The ACLU criticized the program's continued use. We don't let the government watch us all of the time, the organization said in a statement, and track all of our movements, just in case one of us does something wrong and we shouldn't start now. The statement goes on, the fact that they continue to use the technology with no policies in place and without even having control over the data is staggering. Police say that the marathon next weekend will be the last time this program is used, at least for now. If the department wants to go forward with it, it's going to have to figure out a way to pay for it. Reporting live tonight from downtown, I'm Jane Miller, WBAL-TV 11 News.